There's a new video game from developer Niantic called Pokemon Sleep, which, as you can likely deduce, combines classic Pokemon characters with a sleep tracking app. The app recently hit number six on the Apple App Store, so I want to tell you and the listeners a little bit about it. The game uses your phone's accelerometer and microphone to track your sleep habits. The actual gameplay starts when you get a Snorlax, which is a type of Pokemon, to observe its sleeping patterns. Then that Snorlax attracts other Pokemon as you sleep, and the more and the better you sleep, sleep, the more and better Pokemon you can attract. When you wake up in the morning, you see which Pokemon cam comes by, and then you have to feed your Snorlax and do a bunch of other stuff to upgrade its drowsy powers so you can attract better Pokemon. So people have started to play it and say it's actually working for them. It doesn't really improve the quality of your sleep, but what it does do is make you excited to wake up and see which Pokemon yeah. dropped by. The app also immediately makes you do something upon waking up, so people are saying instead of doom scrolling or something like that, it jolts them awake and gives them something to do. So Neil, this might be a must download for us if it helps us get out of gonna, bed in the morning. I was going to say, do you want to try this? I really do want to. I was actually one of the first Pokemon Go players okay. too. Like I was fully in on that, yeah. th that craze. And so I am interested to see what Pokemon Sleep does for me. Um, <laughs> Apparently it's a really bad sleep tracker though. I know. I was reading a few reviews and, and they were like, this thing is useless. I, you know, I used to have a Fitbit and it did a much better job of right. tracking my sleep and waking me up. So if you're trying to look for a, a health app, then maybe this isn't the one. But if you are, a, you know, a future Ash Ketchum or <laughs> someone who was really, really loves Snorlax, then maybe, uh, maybe this is a, an app you might want to use. Yeah. People were calling it a little predatory too because it's kind of like gamifying your sleep. So people People were trying to take like more melatonin so they got better sleep and then also like the actual gameplay is not that fun because the majority of the time you're sleeping and then the time where you're awake you're literally just like feeding right. snorlax so who knows but i do i think niantic it just stays undefeated with targeting these these uh uh like different health outcomes, basically, like Pokemon Go is meant yeah. to, to make you walk. This is meant to make you sleep. And they're selling that $55 uh, Pokemon gadget that you can press instead of hitting your phone to go to sleep. So Pokemon is just so good at monetizing it, its IP. And yeah, I'm definitely going to give this a try. Hey, thanks for watching. And if you want more Morning Brew Daily, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And also check out the rest of our episodes wherever you get your podcasts. New episodes drop at 7 a.m. Eastern, Monday through Friday. And you can email us at morningbrewdaily at morningbrew.com.